it was the countdown that was heard around the Bay Area this weekend. Absolutely, this is amazing. We love it. We came last year, it's awesome. Several hundred showed up in Lafayette for the annual holiday celebration and tree lighting. Oh, Christmas, where everyone gets there was music, food, a range of festivities, but Christopher Samea admits there is another reason to celebrate. The 49ers played a great game, Brock pretty amazing, and uh, we watched it, and then we, we knew we were coming here tonight to watch uh, the tree lighting. We were having a great time. At the Caltrain station in San Francisco, the festivities included collecting toys for donations, while families could watch performances and take a selfie with Santa. In Oakland, the African American Chamber of Commerce held its sixth annual holiday shopping experience, and there was something similar in Richmond. The 61st annual holiday arts festival, where local artists could showcase and sell their artwork. This is so people can see something different and get it from a local maker versus a corporation. So I think that is really nice. Merry Christmas! Ho, ho, ho! Back in Lafayette, this holiday season has extra meaning for the Tong family. Our son's been battling cancer for years. Uh, he is in remission now, but we take every opportunity we can to do something fun with the boys. Bavika Tong's young son, Kabir, just got out of the hospital on Friday after a week-long stay. What did you ask for Santa? You asked for I asked him for gifts. Anything special? <laughs> no, just specifically gifts. You'll take anything. Sometimes simplicity is the key to the holidays. In the East Bay, on San Hassan, ABC 7 News. Yay, thank you so much. <laughs>